oh my gosh, it's weird, I haven't been on the bike for ages. I know you haven't, because you've been like, ah, it's too cold, or oh, it's too windy, or... <laughs> yeah, I feel we're, we're the rider. Very much so. Right, we're off. We're not off to go very far, are we, babe? Um, we're going to, going to go for a little adventure to Dublin Bay. Hello. Morning. Ah, afternoon. <laughs> we're both... We're, uh, this is essentially a combination of a, a bit of a test run just to check all the technologies are working. The technology. Technology. Um, see if the technology is working before we go on our trip. Uh, which is coming up in a little over uh, two weeks. Is it? Just yeah, two weeks. Just, just, yeah, just 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 un under two weeks. Um, so we've got our mesh jackets on. Hey, look. Kim's got her cool one. I've got the girls' one. <laughs> not a girls' one. <laughs> well, it's great. Technically, it's not a girls' one because it's a bloke's jacket. But unfortunately, the colours I don't like at all. Yeah, Kim, Tom likes my one better. Kim's got the cool one, she's got the black and white one, and it's awesome. Oh, I keep forgetting they've made this 80 now. Oh. You can go for it. Anyway, it's a awesome. beautiful, beautiful, beautiful day, and we're going to go to the beach. Yeah, we're going to Dublin Bay. We haven't taken you there before. It's um, quite a long gravel road down there. So, um... It's a, kind of good practice for Tom, a, I think. Yeah, yeah. A gravel road. A gravel Gravel, road. gravel road. Uh, yeah, Kim doesn't pronounce her L's. It's a gravel road. Not gravel road. Gravel. A road. 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 Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anyway, it's been a while since I've been on the bike, so um, hi everyone. It's um, not particularly far, is it? We're just going around the lake a little bit. The other position that we could do is that place that I went to on the FTR the other day, down at uh, Glendu Bay. But this is kind of a bit off-roady, this one. This is not many people go to this one. Although today it'll be, should be uh, pretty busy. Yeah, there'll be a, I saw the young families go down there, it's quite shallow. Yeah, the it? young trendies go down there with their boats and jet skis, don't they? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, beautiful day. So it, it's 22. How does your mesh jacket feel? It's, it's really nice. It's very comfortable. It's like I can feel the breeze going right through it. Me too. Like through the whole, holy bit. The whole. The ventilator <laughs> bit, I should say. Yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's probably any cooler than this. I would be feeling a bit cold, I think. I, yeah, I mean, the cool air is taking the 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 um it's it yeah you're right this is do it up and do the neck up and it's it's quite nice like but, the, but the front is, is quite nice and you know up, up around my neck and my chest yeah but the arms feel like the, i can definitely feel the, the wind go through them and yeah me too so cool. so just remember you'll you'll put you'll want to put a long sleeve merino on underneath anyway Oh, definitely, I will, yeah. And um, it's 22 today, and we'll be, it'll be 32 in summer, up, especially up north when it's 100% humidity. Yeah, I think up, up north will be quite, will be a lot warmer, yeah. Yeah. Although they were saying that the South Island's in for a scorching summer, in the 30s, possibly. Yeah, it's going to be a hot summer, so I think we've done the right thing. Yeah, definitely. We're just going to see how the packing goes and whether or not I can take my leather jacket or not. Um, but we'll see. Yeah, I don't think I don't think we want to be taking your leather jacket to be honest. But anyway, we'll see what happens. Yeah. We'll we'll cruise a little bit, play it by ear a little bit. I'll just overtake this guy. Um. Yeah. So nothing much else to report, have we, babe? Oh, I've just been um, working really, and you know, working hard and. Really looking forward to the holiday. It's been, a, it's been a while since we've had a decent break, I think. It's really COVID. Since COVID, we haven't really had any time off. No. So, um, yeah, both Tom and I have been busting up, actually. It's, um, but I got some recognition last night, uh, last night at my 
work party. I yeah. Won the of the year, so that was Came cool. one person of the year out of about 150 staff, so. Yeah, so I was pretty chuffed with that. That's pretty good going. Okay, here we go. So, just over the river and round the other side of the bottom of the lake, this is a dirt road that turns into quite an off roady road. So, we'll see how we go. I'm going to put it in. Enduro Pro. So is it clicked in? Yep, you've got to hold the clutch in, otherwise it doesn't do it. So all I was doing is, baby, standing up like that. So you do that with me on the back? Yeah, it, it just feels like it's a bit heavier. See, I have, it just makes it... I don't it... like you doing that. <laughs> of course you don't. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it. Doesn't it hurt your legs, though, standing up for that long? Uh, no, I mean, it requires a bit more effort, obviously, than sitting on your ass. Do you want me to stand up as well? No, that would be a terrible idea. <laughs> <laughs> Tub Wiener stands up on the back. <laughs> <laughs> she can't see. Yeah. Tub Wiener see. can't see! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's not so bad, is it? Pretty good going. I mean... I only need to do that when it's quite deep gravel. Right. When it's, you know, if it's, uh, ah, you can't use cruise control in Enduro Pro. Yeah, just, just when it's deep and feels a bit sketchy, I'll stand up. Okay. Or, like on corners and stuff, I'll probably stand up. Yeah. I love it down here, don't you? It's amazing. It's a pretty cool spot, actually. This is our kind of little summer spot. And uh, usually, this is the escape to get away from the tourists, usually. Well, yeah, not the, many tourists know the about The tourists it. don't know about this spot. Uh, unless they were to look on a map, obviously, and Yeah, do a bit of... Dis yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. have they sealed? This is new. Oh, my gosh. They sealed it. Is it that long since we've been here? Has it's been literally a good couple of years. Oh my gosh, babe! Yeah, Can look you at that. Can believe it? I can't believe it. No. Look. <laughs> but that's cool, isn't it? It's really cool. I have to tell, tell Jordan. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this was a pretty choppy dirt road not that yeah, long ago. It was. It was like you know, if you only had a four-wheel drive vehicle, you wouldn't be coming down here really. Here we go. No. It's cr oh, brilliant. Brilliant. Right, here's the uh, very off-roady bit. Let's see how we go, babe. Now, there's some pretty big bumps in the road here, so I'm probably going to... I'll take it steady, but the bike might just sort of start going all over the place. Don't, don't feel like you're going to jump off. Now, I think... We'll go this way. Ooh, look at this. Really don't want to meet something coming the other way. Woohoo! Right, here we go. You all right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can tell when you're worried because you start, you go quiet. The trick with anything with on two wheels is uh, don't go too slow. If you go too slow, you just fall over. Right, here we are. That wasn't a particularly big trip, but this is where we wanted to go. Oh, look, isn't it gorgeous? Yeah, wow. Don't go in the too sandy bit, baby. You'll never get out again. Right there? You want to jump off? You're going to be able to get out of there? Easy peasy, yeah. Right, done. That was fun, babe. It's like a giant dirt bike, isn't it? Like yeah, it is. It's pretty. I am really falling in love with this GS now that I'm doing this sort of stuff. Yes. <laughs> One for me. <laughs> Top Wien is always right. Um, we yeah. got the advice of a lot of our subscribers on board. And um, Well, you didn't take my advice and get some new a new pair of them. Well, I will, all in good time, but we've just spent a lot of money on 
Yeah, I took you. I took you to the glasses place to buy a new pair of them, and, and were, she went and bought a pair of really fancy, girly ones. Girly ones. And you I need another you pair of them for the trip. <laughs> now I've got to buy two pairs of glasses. Uh, my cunning plan. <laughs> Yeah, I need a casual pair, like a bike, pair for the motorbike, and I need a pair for Glam. A pair? A pair. Look at this place, guys and gals. Pretty spectacular. Dublin Bay. Yeah, I love how you can just drive in and drive out. Yeah, it's a, good, it's a really popular spot for kayaking for bringing the wee kids, isn't it? Are we in a good spot there? Because isn't this where everybody brings their boat yeah, in? I don't know why you don't. You're parking it there. Mm, I might just shift it. What did you send that to? Yeah, can you it? take that? I'll put it over there on that grass. Good idea. Make sure there's no potholes in there, though. I think there might be. Oh, um, my jacket's got the keys in the pocket. Just give me my jacket. Yeah. Yeah, good on that bike. Well, I'm super confident on it now, babe, I tell you. After doing some of them dirt tracks and that awesome. I'm feeling super up uh, it's just it's a, bomb there, bike, it's a machine it. that very much feels part of me now to be honest right you know like the XR did after a few years now this is as well um, there's a swing there and everything well, we can set up a little camp <laughs> right here we are Dublin Bay pretty special spot. Um, Wanaka is just over there, over the other side where we've just come from. It's quite good because it's quite a sheltered little spot, isn't it, babe? Yeah, it's awesome. Say hello. <laughs> Hi. I need to get my leather soft up for All right. <laughs> right, you're going to bring all the... I'll, I'll take the towels, leave everything else there, babe. Let me drop my other earplug. Oh, no. Which I'm going to have to find. Well, where did you drop it? Did you... Oh, it's here. I see it. Yeah, the bike's looking very much like it's been off-road because I did that trip the other day on it. There's not many places in the world that you can leave all your valuables in the tank bag and leave the keys hanging out the back of the bike <laughs> and leave all your gear on the ground, eh? Right, I'm. Well, you were given the option to buy some new glasses and you went and bought some fancy. You told me that I should buy them. It's not my fault. You told me to buy them. So no, I picked up a pair exactly the same as them and you went and bought something else. You told me to buy them, that's why. Oh, you're such a liar. <laughs> Right, I'm sure people don't want to see you getting undressed. No! Alright. <laughs> I don't want to. Pretty awesome place. I love how you can come to these places in New Zealand and there's like five people here. Brilliant, eh? Here comes a boat. I'm going to video it. This is what they do here. You just pull in. Don't you reverse your boat in? Uh -huh. Here it goes. What I love is there's no rules, there's no license required, no no permission. Just buy a boat and a tr and a tow bar on your car. Pretty cool boat.
somewhere around there they reverse it in and then leave the truck there Oops. we've got no saddles wow take him for a swim look at that horse in front of it beautiful yeah Off we go. I mean, the years and years and years of us doing downhill mountain biking definitely helps. Yeah, definitely, eh? Yeah. Just choosing your line and stuff like exactly. that. Exactly. Not getting stuck in ruts and not knowing what, you know, knowing when to go slow, when to go fast. That's over the bumps, nice and easy, doesn't it? Oh, uh, it's fine. It's great. All right, here we go. We're hitting the corner. Good job. Oh, you did great. You're going pretty fast through there. Is it better to go fast? Well, it's a fine line between you're going too fast and you're going to crash and die and oh. you're not going fast enough. Right. Do you know what I mean? If you go too slow, it's a nightmare. Uh, if you go too fast, you got you just you just skim across the stones, basically. Oh, my gosh, it must be cold now. I'm happy I've got the jacket on now. Yeah. Brilliant, isn't it? I love the mesh jacket. Oh. <laughs> That's 24. Wow. The power from this bike is just effortless, isn't it? Oh, no. It's just so effortless. I mean, it's the FTR that I rode the other day, the Indian. Oh my gosh, that thing, that gave you a, a proper punch. And when you open it up, this, this is actually quite smooth um, in the power delivery, isn't it? it? It's not nastily quick. It's quick, but it's not like in your off the back. blowing oh. off the back. It just, it does everything so well. Amazing machine. Yeah. Why they're the best selling bike in the world, but Yeah. I mean, like you on the XR. I know I keep saying that. You, there's no way you would have been able to do the stuff that you've been doing recently. Not, no, no, not recently, no. And I wouldn't want to, to be honest, because it would have wrecked it. I feel very different about this bike. I feel like I, sh you know, it's it's to be used and destroyed. <laughs> if that makes oh, sense. Well, I say destroyed. No, well, no, destroyed's a bit, a bit. Um, like it's, it, it's kind of what it's built for, really, isn't it? All round. Yeah. Like durable. It's, it's built to be used. Yeah, exactly. Well, there's, there's actually a lot of bikes out there that are built to be sort of admired and hardly ridden. That you would, you wouldn't want to get them dirty or chip them. Yeah. yeah. You know. Yeah, they're too nice to use. I think the XR was one of those. The, the XR, I was a little bit precious about it, to be honest, because yeah. I just, I loved everything about it. I loved the look of it. But this, even though I do love the look of this, I'm like, I don't care if I scratch it up or use it. I'm just going to use it and enjoy it. Oh, well, that's it. That's what you yeah. should be doing. I mean, we decided this is going to be our bike. Yeah, this is our bike. Yeah. What a day. It's amazing. It? Yeah. It's... See, this isn't a 50 through here now, so you can actually be going through this quite fast. Ooh. They've just changed the speed limit here from 50 to 80. Don't know why, but it's great. <laughs> Should we walk to the gym like we did yesterday? Yeah, let's do that, eh? Oh, well, thanks for watching, folks. There will be 
lots more videos coming very soon because we're about to finish for the year and summer yep. holiday. Yay! Uh, holidays are big, big out, about to begin. Yeah, we we definitely have worked very hard for this break. Um, heartfelt feelings for all the English people who keep writing in the comment section. It's four degrees and raining and horrible. Yeah, uh, it is. That's winter. Yeah, we feel for you. Definitely we feel, feel for, you. for you. I feel there's a, a pang of guilt, but not too much because it's flipping great. Well, the thing is, you know, like, at least you've, you've got us to watch during your winter to cheer you up. <laughs> Yay! Sweet tub wiener. So <laughs> <laughs> we need to get to the gym. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to roll tub wiener to the gym this <laughs> afternoon. Oh, no. And it's just like that Christmas season, you know, it's like when everybody eats and drinks yeah. too much. And there's parties galore. And